Hey there, this is Matteo from Spalho Milano and today we're in San Cristoforo neighborhood, more precisely in Via Remo della Valle, in order to show you a shared apartment with two bedrooms, two bathrooms, kitchen, living room and two balconies, which is located on the fifth floor, is accessible both through the stairs and through this elevator, which you can see just behind me. So now let's just go ahead and let me show you around. So as we walk in, we access the entrance hall and on the left we have the kitchen with the first balcony. On our right hand side we have the living room with the second balcony. While proceeding through the main corridor, we have the two bathrooms on the left, so the first one and the second one. At the end we have a closet. Here on the right we have bedroom number one, while this is bedroom number two, which is currently occupied. So we quickly begin our tour with the shared spaces, which are indeed the kitchen. So this is a lovely and fully furnished apartment, as you can tell. In the kitchen we find plenty of utensils, including the coffee machine over here. We have a set of drawers with some tools in it. Here we have a modern microwave. The dishwasher is not functioning at the moment, it might be fixed soon. We have an oven with the gas stove built in on the top. A kettle for the tea, as well as a large double sink over here. But on the top we have the cupboard with all the plates and the rack to dry them after washing. All over here on the top, as you can notice, we've got plenty of storage compartments to store the food and the other utensils. Behind the entrance door, we have another older microwave and a cabinet to store the pots which are provided with the apartment. While on this side, we have a little table with three seats where you can have your meals. At the end of the kitchen, we find this humongous freezer and fridge. Very spacious. And beside this window we find a French door which gives access to the private balcony for this apartment which goes all around the corner here on the right. It is an interior one so that's the courtyard of our residential building and the access is just down here. You can already spot the nearest supermarket which is just a few steps away. It's a pretty nice view from up here. So walking over in that direction, you have the bus stop of line number 64, which connects you to the underground line number one, and especially to Primaticcio, in just uh, 10 minutes. So it's very handy. And now going back through this beautiful entrance hall, we can show you the living room, which is super luminous, very spacious as well. We find this large classic couch, a beautiful painting on the top and from here you can enjoy this uh, classic, classic style TV right in front of us. We have another table here in the middle with four seats and a vintage cabinet here. Now through these French doors we access the second balcony of the apartment which is on the opposite side but still an interior one. Here we find uh, some plants and the view is still actually quite nice as we are overlooking this uh, green spot. We also have some car parks all around. We're also pretty close to the San Cristoforo Passante train station. It's a quick connection to the other sides of the city and especially to Porta Romana and Piazzale Lodi. Well, as for the two bathrooms, in the first of them we find a shower there at the end and we also have the washing machine down here. On the top we find some rack to dry your clothes after washing and here we have the sink with its mirror on the top and just the water in this case. Well as for the second bathroom which is just around the corner in this case we find a large bathtub still with its uh, hose we have another sink with its mirror on the top and in this case we find both of the toilets, the water every day. There's a luminous window still on the interior side, so that's the balcony on which we were just before. And there's a cabinet here to store your hygiene products. Now continuing through the main corridor, as we mentioned here at the end, we have a closet to store in sort of items and bear in mind that some of this stuff will be taken away by the landlords. Now as for bed number two, it is currently occupied long term, so we're not able to show it to you, but we can definitely show you bedroom number one, 
which is super nice as well. Fully furnished again and very luminous with this uh, humongous BLT in wardrobe all over this wall, which is very nice and deep. There's definitely plenty of space inside. Another thing to mention is that this double bed is actually composed of two single ones. So if you prefer, you can just split them into twins. We've got a full length mirror here in the corner. And we've got the two bedside tables on the side of the bed. The bedroom also comes with this uh, flat screen TV. And there's, again, plenty of natural light flowing in through this uh, very large French window, which is sharing the same view as the second balcony that we showed you. So all the nice green spot. So this is overall a very nice accommodation, very classic style. Conveniently located with the bus stop just out of your doorstep. We have uh, plenty of sporting facilities nearby, including a swimming pool. And there's also a super nice, good restaurant called uh, Beato Te. Just walking distance. And with this we showed you everything. So thanks for watching. See you next time. Ciao ciao.